So you want to run Godot on an old Windows PC. You have a few options. Let's have a look at them. The first, if you have run Godot 4 and receive an error about being unable to initialize the Vulkan display driver, you're likely using an old PC that doesn't support Vulkan or very out of date drivers. All is not lost. Godot 4 has a fallback to use the older OpenGL standard. Let's see how to run it like this. Extract the download. So right click, extract all and then click the Extract button. I can't do this because I've already done it. So you do that, I'll click Cancel. Then go to the folder, and if you've tried to run it and you get the error, what you want to do is right click and either say Pin to Taskbar, like so, or right click and Pin to Start. And then what you'll want to do is on this version, if you're doing it through the start bar, click more, open file location, right click on the highlighted icon, and then you would have this. So if it's in a location with a space in the name, you are likely to have quotes around it like so. Otherwise, if not, like you'd just have it like this. What you want to do is at the very end of the line, whether there's quotes or not, so if there's a quote, you want to do it after the quote. If there's no quote, you want to do it before. And then you just press space, hyphen, hyphen, or dash, dash, rendering, hyphen, driver, hyphen, open GL3. You then want to click apply, OK, and then go back to the start button and then click and it should open and run OK. Likewise, if you're using the taskbar version, you want to right click on the icon, right click on where it says Godot engine properties. And then again, at the end, space hyphen hyphen rendering hyphen driver hyphen open GL3, apply and OK. And then if you click on it, it should load. If it doesn't, you might not be able to run Godot 4. In that case, you'll likely have to use Godot 3, which is version 3.6 at the time of recording. So the way we do this is we go to godotengine.org and you can either click the looking for Godot 3 button or click download and then the looking for Godot 3 button and then just download the file and then extract as normal and that should work. Basically, Vulkan was introduced to Godot 4, Godot 3.6 still uses OpenGL by default. So you actually have to have a pretty old PC not to be able to support Vulkan in some way. Um, the earliest NVIDIA cards to support it were the NVIDIA GTX 600 series and the AMD Radeon HD 7000 series, both of which were released in 2012. So you might just need to update your graphics drivers. So what you can do to check to make sure you've actually got a graphics card that is capable, uh, click the Windows key, type system information, go to components, go to display, and what you'll see is I've got uh, two devices. I've got the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2070 and the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1050. Um, both of those are of an age that can support Vulkan. Um, like I said, anything newer than, say, uh, a 660 from NVIDIA or an HD 7000-ish should be able to do it. Um, what you might just need to do is go to the NVIDIA drivers website and you can then go drivers and then you can either use the GeForce Experience or you basically just click on uh, so 600 series or whatever whatever version that it says you have here. Um, you basically want to find the drivers there. Alternatively, you know, AMD drivers. Um, I think it's in here. Radeon graphics and AMD chipsets drivers. 
and then graphics and then you'll just have to find the version that you've got so you know 7000 series upwards and then just download and install their drivers and hopefully um, you should be able to run Godot 4. If not, like I said, version 3.6 is going to be supported for quite a while. There are some differences in the way you use 3.6 and 4, but you know, uh, there's still a lot of tutorials out there for 3. Point, uh, for version 3 and most of that that you learn in 3 can be applied relatively easily to 4. It's probably easier to go from 3 to 4 than it is to go from 4 back to 3. So if you learn how to use Godot 3 and then you can go forward and then you'll just be using a nicer version of the engine. You might want to consider if you can upgrading your graphics card. You probably don't need to go very modern in order to support Godot 4 if you want to just, you know, try it out. The main issue with Godot 4, like I said, is the fact that it uses Vulkan, which is a newer but slightly lesser supported version of the graphics API that runs, you know, your graphics card. Um, but like I said also earlier on, it does have a fallback for OpenGL3, so hopefully that will work for you. And yeah, I hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.